In this episode of Fun Time with Pepper, astronaut Pepper learns about the planet Uranus. Pepper travels to Uranus and finds out many interesting facts about the seventh planet from the Sun. Pepper also encounters the Fluffets, that take astronaut Pepper on a tour. Would you like to travel to Uranus? Fun Time with Pepper Hi everyone, today our destination is Uranus. The planet of mystery and, well, funny jokes about its name. <laughs> Uranus is the seventh planet from the sun. What? Well, what do we have here? A space explorer. Wow, you're a beauty, Uranus. <laughs> Thank you. I don't get many compliments out here. No way. Hey, why do you tilt sideways like that? A giant collision long ago knocked me to this 98 degree angle. Yay! It makes me unique among the other planets. And who are you? I'm Pepper, space explorer extraordinaire. I'm here to learn all about you. Do you mind if I ask you some questions? Indeed, ask away little one. Why are you called Uranus? Uranus is named after the Greek god of the sky, Auranos. Oh, Greek name, huh? That's cool. Hey, how long does it take you to orbit the sun? It takes about 84 Earth years for me to complete one orbit around the sun. What? No way! I would only last until my first birthday. If I'm lucky enough to live that long. How many moons do you have? I have 28 moons. Miranda, Errol, Umbriel, Titania, and Obero are the names of the larger ones with Titania being the largest and the 8th largest moon in the solar system. Oh yeah. You have 28 moons? That's cool. Do you guys get along? Most of the time. Sometimes we fight over who gets the last of the green cheese. If you don't mind me asking, how big are you? I'm about 4 times wider than Earth. What? With a diameter of about 31,518 miles. No way! I blame it on too much green cheese and not enough cardio. Do you mind if I went down onto your surface? You are welcome to come closer to me, but I don't have a surface. I'm made out of gas, Yikes. primarily hydrogen, helium, and methane. That's why my color is bluish. It's the methane. If you go down, the Fluffits will answer more of your questions. Don't hit her in the eye. Good grief, man. <laughs> Oh, so cute. Hi, who are you guys? Hi, Pepper. Uranus said you would be coming. We're the Fluffets. Fluffets? Yes, the Fluffets. Float with us and we'll show you around. Brr, it's colder than an ice cream party here. How cold is that anyway? It's a minus 317 degrees, but don't worry. Your spacesuit will keep you warm. So I guess you're mainly made out of hydrogen and... Helium and methane. Yeah. It's the methane that gives us our bluish color. Hey, girl. Oh, yeah. That's methane acid. Let's go higher and we'll show you Uranus's rings. Uranus has 13 rings. They're not as flashy as Saturn's. Why be flashy when you can be mysterious? Oh, yeah. Wise words, young one. How was Uranus discovered? Uranus was discovered by the astronomer William Herschel in 1781, using a telescope. Okay. What spacecraft has visited Uranus? The only spacecraft from Earth to fly by Uranus was Voyager 2, back in 1986. No way! What is the gravity like on Uranus? Uranus's gravity is slightly less than Earth. What? A person weighing 100 pounds would only weigh 89 pounds on Uranus. Oh. How far is Uranus from Earth? Uranus is about 1.6 billion miles from Earth on its closest approach. No way. Speaking of Earth, I should probably get back. <coughs> Thanks for visiting us, Astronaut Pepper. We hope you come and visit us again soon. Thanks, Fluffets. See you later. Thank you, Astronaut Pepper, for your curiosity. Thank you, Uranus. Remember, even the quietest planets have stories to share. That was really enjoyable to go to Uranus. 
What do you think? Would you like to go to your lesson day? Captain Pepper signing off.